Jim, first your assessment of that. I can't believe we lost the game, to be honest. Um, looking at the game in its entirety, purely on a chance basis, uh, I, I don't know how we lost the game. Um, thinking back, and I've not really reviewed it yet, but um, Kianese has a great chance. Um, eight yards out, it's unfortunate, keeper saves it. I mean, Carol Mitchell going down the side. Uh, not truly a 1v1, but good chance. Cameron John hits the crossbar. I mean, Kian does a, a good bit of work off the other side. And I just don't really remember Ebsley doing anything. Uh, anything that created us any danger, really. And we have to we have to take our medicine and accept that we, we gave them two goals today. Um, that's, that's what we feel disappointed about within our camp. We accept it. We take it. We take it on the chain. We have to. But um, we gave them two goals in a game that... They really struggled to create anything against us. Um, yeah, I, I really thought on the side of the pitch the game was was coasting along to what was going to be uh, a stalemate draw type of event because I just thought we're not going to convert any of the chances here that we're having. Um, but ultimately, uh, in that sort of coasting mentality that I think we, we maybe was in, I don't know, um, it cost us last minute winner, we got stung um, in a game when, I don't know, maybe maybe, maybe the fact that we played Tuesday, they didn't travel for us, not that, I, I don't know, I don't know if these things uh, maybe had an effect on the feel, the feel of how the game was in the second half, I don't know, but truthfully, I can't believe we lost the game. Um, you had some players missing as well today. Can you update us on, on those? Yeah. Um, Damani Mella uh, pulled a hamstring in the last game, unfortunately. Um, in the second half in the last game, which was which was a, a, a surprise um, and obviously a disappointment. He reported the next day a real tightness in his hamstring and we got that scanned and he's got a... He's got a a, a grade two, two B, I think it is, uh, which is uh, basically a, a five-week injury. Uh, Tyree Sinclair uh, has rolled his ankle, um, so we're not too sure uh, how long he's going to be just yet. Um, that's early stages that one, so we'll see. Um, who else did we have missing? Robin, remind me. Gilmore. Harvey, two match suspension. He got a tenth yellow card. Um, which we were informed the next day, which was a blow again because, um, yeah, Damani, Harvey both had brilliant games the other night uh, and were, were, were obviously losses to the team. But well, um, we had players ready to come in and fight for the shirt and put on a performance and hopefully help us win today. Uh, but we, we didn't manage to do so. Obviously, you had that really important win on Tuesday. Where do you think, sort of, today? you're at going forward now for the rest of the season because you know how tight this league is it's it's unbelievable isn't it really when you look at the table yeah it's crazy I've not seen anything like it um, I don't know how results went today we were watching some of the the Dorkin Chesterfield game on the way in and that looked like it was headed Dorkin's way did it end up that way yeah um, yeah I don't I don't know truthfully that that's my challenge to the players um, amongst all the backdrop of noise that's going on at the football club my challenge to the players is how focused can we remain um, to try and surprise people and as I've often said this season uh, outperform what is going on at the football club uh, because everything around that noise um, I'm, not, I'm not playing it down by calling it noise it's, it's incredibly serious of course the survival of the football club is incredibly serious and the most important thing but our challenge is to try and uh, remain tunnel visioned on, on trying to win the next game, trying to win the next game. Um, we wasn't able to replicate uh, our, our last performance um, in this game, but still, still, we shouldn't be going away with anything less than a draw today. And that's, that's being as fair as I possibly can be. Uh, what's it mean for the rest of the season? Don't know really, Robin. All I know is that I think we should try and think no more than just our next performance. And, we're back on a train down to Tuesday night. Uh, back on a train uh, down here on Tuesday night to Barnet uh, for a big game, and I don't think we can focus on anything ahead of that really.